Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome to my first episode of my World of Warcraft Let's Play. So guys, I'm going to first show you what server I'm going to be playing on. In case any of you guys want to play with me, that would be that would be fine. I'm going to be on Sargeras, which is a PvP server, and I'm going to be on the Alliance side. And the reason I'm picking this server is because it's like it's like overrun with Alliance players, so we're going to like own in the PvP. And I've had some pretty bad luck in the past um with PvP, so I picked this server. And I have a couple characters on this server, none none level capped, but this is the one I'm going to be on, guys. So if you want to play with me, just let me know. That wouldn't be a problem. Okay, so I'm going to create a new character. I'm not sure exactly which one to make. Um, I decided to do a Let's Play for this, guys, because um, a lot of people really enjoy this game. So I figured I'd do it. And, you know, I really like this game, too. And since the expansion is coming out, um, I figured it would be a good time. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick an Alliance character. And they, cha they totally changed this around. I haven't played in a while. And, yeah, this looks a lot different than it used to. Um, I'm not sure what to go with. We have to pick. We have to make an awesome character, and I, I don't want to go with Worgen because I feel like the last couple characters I made were Worgens. So I'm thinking human, maybe human. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make it look like myself if I can. All right, so let's go with the class. Um, all right, so we have the choice of warrior, paladin, hunter, rogue, priest, mage, warlock, and death knight. I have like a ton of death knights and I want to I want to do this let's play right from the beginning so I don't want to start with death knight. Those of you who haven't played this game, um I suggest watching these um to keep watching this um series because this actually is a really good game and you know, you might be interested in it if you watch a little bit of it. But I'm not going to go with death knight cuz you start at a higher level. Let's see. I I don't like I don't I'm not big on the cloth classes like the warlock and the mage, priest. I don't know. I like I like to just power through the monsters. You know, I like to be able to solo stuff. I think I'm gonna go with hunter. I've never leveled a hunter up to the cap, so I think I'm gonna go with that. Let's change to male and try to make him look like me if I can. That would be the most awesome way. Whoa, they really have changed this since last time I um made this. It's gonna be tough to make him look like me since he looks like he's about um 20 years older than me. But we'll see what we got. <laughs> there are, and this game does not have a hell of a lot of choices, but this game really is known for its gameplay. So. What what is this? The skin color? I don't know. It's skin. I'm this skin color. All right, let's go with the face. All right, see if I get his face look anything like mine. They all look the same to me. I usually don't pay. I don't usually don't go too much into the character creation, like too serious into it. In this game, usually only in the games where it's like really good. In this game, it's like mediocre. Okay, so my hairstyle. <laughs> so far, this doesn't look anything like me. By the way, this is. <laughs> I would say this is probably the closest so far. Let's take a look. Okay, I don't have a ponytail, guys. I don't have a ponytail. But um, my hair is short, and that's uh, I don't I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with this. I have no idea. This is probably this. Is sadly, oh oh oh, there we go. All right, that is closer to my hairstyle. I think mine's a little shorter though. All right, so hair color, dark hair. So I think we're good on this one. My hair's pretty. It's like blackish. Black. Okay, facial hair. See if I get my facial hair. I like this is like my favorite thing about games is trying to make the character look exactly like myself. And usually in the games with really good character creations, I could make them look almost exactly like me. And this is this does not look like me at all. Um, there really isn't any that have exactly how I look. <laughs> I don't have a mustache. Pretend this is me, sorta, with with no mustache. This <laughs> doesn't look like me though. I sorta got. Okay, so um, all right, I gotta come up with an awesome name. An awesome name. Okay. I'm not very good at this, and I think I've, I've pretty much taken all my good good names. I think I already made strongest. I think I, I like to go with stronger. I like the I like the I like those kind of names. Show some strength. Going with stronger, and it's not available. Damn it. Maybe I maybe that's the one I took. I have no idea. Damn. Okay. Pat kills you. Now that's a name. All right. So when I'm doing the PvP, I'll be ready. All right, so this is what we are going to start with. And I actually, I, I think I have the volume set on off from last time I was on this. I think I'm going to switch that right when we get back, in, right when we get into the game. This game does a pretty good, um, pretty good audio music. This game has pretty good music. That's what I want to say. And I think I, I think it's set on off right now. I'll go into the settings right when we get into the game. And uh, put it on, which I've made that mistake when I first started recording. Videos come out pretty bad, but yeah, we are just waiting on the loading screen now, and hopefully we will get right into this. Um, just a little little cut scene right at the beginning, and probably not gonna be able to hear it because I have the volume on off, but it's okay. It's it's not a big deal. I'll you know I'll pretend. Um, I know what's going on. It's like talking about the human race and Stormwind. It's 
awesome. That's all. Okay, I'm canceling it because I don't have the volume set anyway. Yeah, I have no idea what it actually says. It's nothing important. And I, I don't know if I should... You know, usually I don't... Let's get the volume on, actually. Let's go to system and sound. And yeah, actually... Actually, it's on. It's just on so low you couldn't hear it. So this this sounds good. All right, so the volume is set good. Okay, so guys, one thing... um. I don't usually read the storyline. I don't know if you guys want me to. I could. I could. I could read this guy's voice. So, you're the new recruit from Stormwind, eh? I'm Marshal McBride. What a weird name. Commander of this garrison. Glad to have you on board. Looks through some papers. Pat kills you. It is Pat kills you, right? You've arrived just in time. The Blackrock Orcs have managed to sneak into Northshire through a break in the mountain. My soldiers are doing the best that they can to push them back, but I fear they will be overwhelmed soon enough. So overwhelmed soon. I can't even talk. All right, heads northwest into the forest and kill the attacking Blackrock Wargs. Help my soldiers. All right, we could do that. We could do that. All right, so um, guys, um, one thing I wanted to mention is I actually know a ton about this game. So if anyone had any questions, and I'm already getting invited to guilds. Are right, supposed to have some mail? Oh yeah, they they switched the since the new patch. Um, I guess they don't give you the um, the mounts and stuff in your mailbox anymore. All right, so let's actually take a look. I just was curious of this. So they've moved a few things around since I last played. I just want to take a quick look. It's a little. Oh, okay. So there's a mounts tab now. There was not a mounts tab, and I have this awesome mount. Awesome. Twenty five dollars off the Blizzard store. I didn't pay for it. I I bought it with gold off some dude in my old guild. It was worth it. Okay, so, um, you see the little quest on the side. Basically, it's gonna see exactly what you gotta do. And on the mini-map, it shows you where you gotta go. So, we are gonna, we're gonna own some, some of these wolves. Yep, wolves. And now we got one move, so. We got one move, and that's all we got for now. And you get into lots of moves as you go in this game. And as I said, guys, if any of you would like to play this with me, actually, I gotta change a couple settings. There's a couple things you want to do, usually right when you start. And um, one is auto loot. You want it just to loot for you. You don't have to click on it. It just saves a lot of time. And I think they actually added AOE looting, which is kind of interesting. Because like, sometimes you like solo stuff and um, you want to loot a bunch of monsters at the same time. I'm probably going to get invited to a decent guild. And you actually get buffs from a high level guild. So I, the reason I canceled the first one is because... I'll be honest, I'm going to join one for the buffs. You're not supposed to do that, but I'll level a little bit quicker. And yeah, this move, guys, I didn't read it to you. An instant shot that causes 100% weapon damage plus 10 is arcane damage. I picked Hunter. Hunter's cool. You got a pet with you. It's one of the few classes that has that. And that is the reason that I chose it. And so right now, we are we are helping the soldiers right now. Killing these wolves, which aren't even aggressive, so it's kind of puzzling. But it's all right. Well, like I'm saying, anyone want to play with me, you know, just let me know. We can do, like, a dungeon or something. That's what I figured would be probably be the easiest to do. I know lots of people ask me um, for Minecraft to play, and, you know, it's a lot harder to set stuff up in Minecraft. In this game, you can just log on and just play, you know what I mean? You got to set up a server, you got to do all that stuff for Minecraft. So this would be really easy. I wouldn't mind playing with anyone, really, if they're just join the server or whatever. It doesn't matter to me. And then be in a video. It's cool. Okay. So, yeah, level 10 guild. I think I want, I want it closer to level 25, to be honest. I've actually started guilds myself. Okay, so you've brought us a little time. Oh, you've bought us, not brought us. You've bought us a little time, Pat kills you. But we've gotten even bigger problems to deal with now. And he gives me, like, some shoes as a surprise. Runner's, sh runners boots. Who runs in boots? Okay. The invading, the invading orcs aren't fools. They are sizing us up now, making sure that when they attack, it will, it will be to their advantage. In the forest to the northwest, our Blackrock spies, they peer at us through spyglasses, watching our every move, waiting. I want you to fight to the, I want you to take the fight to them. Kill the Blackrock spies. We must show them that we know they are watching us and that we are prepared. All right, we can do that. All right, so these boots we got. All you got to do go to the inventory, bomb screen, right-click, put it on you. Um, hit C. I'm just, I'm just going through some, like, obvious stuff. Just, you know, might help people who haven't played before but figure might as well so yeah what we're gonna do oh where's my where's my companion we always start with a nice little companion whoa this looks like oh 25 that's the highest level guild let's just say thank you okay so yeah i don't know they this is, this is my pet 
So these are all my pets. You get all your pets now that since the new patch. The new patch really changed a lot of stuff. I would like to summon a pet. I don't know how. I think I need to talk to a trainer or something now. I, they switch things around a little bit. Usually you'd just be able to use it. But whatever. And as I said before, all you gotta do is follow the mini-map right here. And we will see what I gotta do. And if you see these dead guys on the ground, apparently someone already killed them. And here's one. There's one for us. We need to kill eight of these guys. And what I love to do um, is usually attract like tons of monsters and just kill everything. But these monsters are not aggressive. And you see how they're in yellow? If they're in red, then they're aggressive. And they always start off the game nice and easy. And this game, is, this game isn't too bad. I'm going to say it's... Um, for, as for a challenge, there isn't too much challenge in the questing. Most of the stuff is in the dungeons and the raids. Um, the questing used to be much more difficult when this game first came out, but they kind of like dumped it down a little bit for you know grow a wider audience. Because there's lots of uh, group quests that were changed, um, and I think really the reason they were changed is because a lot of people are level capped, so it was much harder to find a group. So now that they're pretty much pretty much the quests are soloable now, all of them. Back when it first came out, though, I remember uh, I didn't I didn't play when it first came out. I came after the first expansion, but um, they were there were tons that were not soloable, at least from what I remember. That where you'd have to group for them. But now it's kind of hard to find a group for some of the lower stuff. It's like that in all MMORPGs. Anyone that's played one knows that. That if it's not a new game, it is a little on the difficult side. But since this game is really popular, you're gonna see people around. I see other people fighting. I see something happening. So you could find a group. But it's just not as easy as it was back then when you'd see, like, tons and tons of people. Alright, what the hell am I doing killing wolves? I'm just talking and I'm killing the wrong monsters. I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. I was getting too into the conversation with you guys. I just started I just started killing the wolves. You know what? They, they wanted them dead, so I was, I was extra helping. I killed more than they needed. Alright, so we'll kill all these guys. And yeah, getting some really bad loot. So guys, what I plan on doing is um i'm gonna play through the whole game i plan on doing that i want to do it pretty quickly too i want to um ooh, we leveled we are level three i didn't even notice when we hit level two i, I honestly i didn't notice yeah, it goes so quick at the beginning but um i want to play through the whole game and i'm going to do it pretty quickly i may make these episodes a little bit longer than most of the episodes of the let's plays that i've done so far just because you know these this this is a long game it's a long way to 85 and i you know i might make them a bit longer for the people that like to watch them See, there's another player right here. So, you know, it's not unpopulated. This is probably the most populated game you're going to see. This is the most popular MMORPG. So these are players around. So, yeah. You're going to see plenty of people. And there's a nice dragon. I think my dragon's better. What do you think? What do you guys think? I want you to comment and tell me which dragon is better. I think mine is. I'm just going to say. All right. So let's hand this in. To Marshall McBride. That is a weird last name. Excellent work, Pat kills you. You've turned out to be quite an asset to this garrison. It's time for you to train. And he gave me some nice he gave me some pants. Nice guy. Thank you for the pants. I was asked to bring you I was asked to bring this to your attention as soon as you return from dealing with the Blackrock spies, Pat kills you. That's like I have like a weird name, it's like not a real name. But whatever. I should just say Pat. I'm gonna say Pat from now on. Pat. It appears to be a letter sealed with the insignia of Ashley Blank, our local hunter trainer. I wouldn't hesitate to read it before you go about any of your business here in the Abbey. So, in the Abbey. I don't know what Abbey means. I'm guessing it's like a little town, a little small town or something maybe. I don't know. I'm not familiar with that word. And we got the hunter trainer right here. And my, you know what? You know what, lady? I should be training you because look how much bigger my pet is than yours. Owned you. Okay, here we go. Etched letter. Should I do a girl voice? Hello, Pat Kiz. Oh, Pat. Hello, Pat. Is there something I could do for you? Alright, that was ridiculous. Okay, I'm just gonna talk normal. So you've received my note. Excellent. You've proven yourself quite capable in dealing with those orcs. As you continue to grow in power, I will teach you some new techniques. Usually you don't read this stuff, but I'm trying to keep it interesting. Alright. I've heard about your help in clearing out some of the orcs. You've shown that you can handle yourself in combat. As, as you get more experience in combat, You'll start learning how to do new things. I want you to go get some more experience. Okay, so, so get some experience. Yes, we need to use one of our moves. We have a new move. Let's talk to her. I, I think you don't need to talk to trainers anymore. I mean, I didn't really read the patch notes very thoroughly. You used to have to get all your moves from the trainer. I happen to have another move on me, so I'm assuming that they have changed that. So we just need to practice Steady Shot. Reach level 3 to learn Steady Shot. Then find a training dummy south of the entrance. Alright, south of here. Alright, this way should be south. And I, I've leveled here before. Oh, they're like right here. 
Okay. So just this move, um, this move, you know, takes like two seconds to shoot. Pretty easy to do. But yeah, they start you off with like one move. This game ends out, you end out with like 50 moves. But yeah, it's not too bad. I have no complaints about it. I play if you if you played EverQuest 2, they start you with like as many moves as this game has at the end game, and you get like hundreds. It's ridiculous. I can't even keep track of them. Come here, come back, Wolf. I I can't really control him at this point. I don't think we've gotten the we haven't gotten the thing yet. I we haven't I need to level up a little before I could actually tell him to like what to do and stuff. All right, maybe I should do a woman voice. I'm gonna try to make it sound like it's really a girl. Tell me if this sounds like a like a woman. I I don't know if I can do it. I knew you would master sh steady shot quickly. Okay, that does not sound like a girl at all. All right. While you were training, I received an urgent message from Sergeant Willem. Turns out that the Blackrock Orcs have hired goblin assassins. They ambushed our battalion behind the abbey. William has asked you to send him a hero. And I'm a hero, guys. You have to go help them, Pat. Find Sergeant William north of the abbey at the command tent. Go. All right. All right, we're going. All right, where is it? Gotta go around the building. No, I'm going the wrong way. All right. So we are, we're almost level four. This experience bar right here, guys. If you didn't notice, you probably did. So yeah, this may, I may gain, I may gain from this. So it's, it's this dude, this is Sergeant Willem. They have some weird names. And the reason I'm reading this, these things, guys, is because there's actually some really good quests, too. Um, these aren't, you know, just starter quests, not too exciting, but there's some really good ones. It's true. We were ambushed. I don't dare set any more soldiers out there and risk losing them too. I need a volunteer, someone willing to risk their life. Whoa, that is a creepy looking goblin. I gotta say. Okay. Have you ever seen a goblin, Pat? The, oh, I, got, I, I lost his epic voice. Have you ever seen a goblin, Pat? They're wretched little green skinned monsters that love only two things, gold and themselves. The Black Ark Orcs have enlisted the aid of the Goblin Assassins to kill our soldiers. If you look at, to, if you look to the field in the north, you can barely make out their silhouettes sneaking around in the grass. I need you to head out there and kill every Goblin that you see. They need to learn that nobody messes with the Alliance. That's right, guys. Alliance for the win. Although I have, like, I think I have mostly, I have mostly horde characters to be honest. All right, this guy. He doesn't, he doesn't, you know, he doesn't seem like he'd have as cool of a voice, so. Have you embraced the holy light yet, brother? Sorry, that might sound a little gay. Um, hold on. <laughs> it, is, it is through the holy light that we are saved. It is through the holy light that I am able to heal these overly demanding soldiers. And it is through the holy light that you, were, that you will be able to venture out into the field to the north and rescue our fallen brothers. Take this prayer book with you into the field and cast the light's healing touch on the injured. Alright, I could do that. I could do that, bro. Alright, so, a couple quests. Alright, so, these are... Who's killing all the monsters? Oop, loot. No, no, that's the quest. This is the quest. I thought I, I thought it was loot. Alright, so we need four of these. So, yeah, I am... I'm, I just saved his life. He was dead. I brought him back to life. I'm like a doctor or something. Okay, so I gotta kill eight of these guys. <laughs> Let's just... Let me just take a look at these guys. They are looking pretty creepy. I, you know, they're, they're, you know, fashionable dressers. More than me. Have you seen me? Look at, I don't even, oh, wrong button. Yeah, look at me, I look like a homeless person. At least he has some, I might take those clothes. Alright, so we gotta kill eight of these guys. They don't look like they could hurt anyone, they're so little. Alright, you are dead. You have to do that to a lot of guys. A lot of little goblins. You know, it's mean to kill the goblins. Alright, yeah, the goblins are, um, they are horde. Horde side. I forget that sometimes. I feel like the Worgen, which is the wolf class, like a new, in the, one of the expansions, um, they came out with Worgens and Goblins as, um, as classes, and I really felt that Worgens should have been, should have been the Horde side, and the Goblins should have been, um, Alliance. It just would have made more sense, because the Worgens are like, I don't know the storyline of the game, though. I mean, I didn't write the storyline, because it probably has to do with the storyline of the game, like, because there was, like, Warcraft before this. This isn't, like, the first Warcraft. So it probably came to the storyline, but it just looks to me like um, a badass wolf would be Horde. But you know what they might have wanted to do is put a badass character on the lion side, because they don't really have them. They're mostly like human and like night elf and stuff. They didn't have a badass one, so that may be the reason they did it. But it's probably has to, it most likely has to do with the storyline of the game, which came from like the Warcraft uh, 1, 2, and 3, I think. I don't know. I never played either of them. Any of them. Not either. Any. I haven't played any of them. Okay, so I need to kill three more of these guys. 
And as you can see, oh, oh, I forgot to mention, people get so pissy about this usually, is that I click the buttons. I am a clicker. I will always be. I've been playing MMOs for like many years, and it's just a habit I started off with, and it's so like embedded into my brain that I don't even think about using the keyboard. Plus, I gotta say, it, it, bothers, my it bothers my wrist a little bit. I don't know why to um, use it. Because when I, you play, if you've played a Terra Online, which is a game that came out not that long ago, um, you have to use the buttons. And yeah, it was, it was fine. But um, I feel like it bothers my wrist a little bit. I don't know. I'm just more comfortable clicking. And I, it doesn't really it doesn't really affect you that much. Some people may think it does. It doesn't really. I mean, I've topped DPS in um, like regular Dragon Soul and stuff before. I'm, I'm not real serious. I'm like a casual player too. So it's not really a big deal. You can play however the hell you want really. It doesn't matter. But, uh, okay, so, <clears throat> sorry, throat's a little, little dry. It's a little dry, I need some water. Alright, so, by the light be renewed. Okay, I don't know if that was his voice. Alright, so we're gonna hand this in. I think you, I think his voice was different before. I think you now understand the power of the light. The light giveth, giveth hope, brother, and the light taketh from the darkness. Blessed be the light. Alright, and he gave us some nice bracers. Okay, everyone's giving us crap, but. Alright, so I'm done doing his voice. I don't think I can do that any longer. Did I put on the pants? I never... Oh, no, I... No. I never put on the pants that they gave me. My mistake. I am looking fashionable now. Keep pressing the wrong button. So, yeah, I got some nice pants. I don't... Like, my pants look like I, I just got them. While my shirt looks like it's about 40 years old and I found it in a dumpster. That will teach those monsters. They'll think twice before taking another mercenary job for orcs. And I got a nice belt. It's like a, isn't it like a weird thing to get when you think? Like, you like help them out and they're like, here, have this pair of pants. It just seems like, it just seems really weird to me. But obviously, it, you know, fits well with the game. Excellent work, Pat. The rear is now officially clear. We'll take care of the stra stragglers. I want you to go back to Marshal McBride, standing in front of Northshire Abbey, south of here, and let him know that the goblin situation is under control. Farewell, Hunter. Farewell. All right, let's give it a let's give him a bye. See a nice wave bye to you, my friend. Thank you for the clothes. Maybe they just think I'm so I'm like so like homeless looking. They're like, man, you gotta have some, you gotta get some newer clothes, and they just give it to me because I did I helped them. All right, let's get this guy. With your help, we have managed to secure the northern and western sectors of Northshire. We still have a rather large. Contingency of Blackrock orcs to the east, and they've begun burning down the forest. Oh no. The orcs have begun burning down. The you just said that. They have taken over the vineyard to the east and are planning their final assault against us. They must be stopped. Head east across the river and kill the rampaging Blackrock orcs. Collect their weapons as proof of their demise and return to me. You are our only hope, Pat. And they, you know, they say I'm their only hope, but I'm level 4. And these guys are level 80, and they have, like, gold around their name, which means they're, like, awesome. They got, what, 25,000 hit points, and I got 213, and I'm the only hope? I don't know why. All right. All right, girl voice again. I got this. I'm, this was, I might get good at this. I might get good at voicing. You know, you know when you watch cartoons and stuff, you know, a lot of the voices are done by, like, a guy for a girl. I'm going to be good at this. Times like these, man. <laughs> I can't even talk, okay. Times like these make me long for when the defiers were still around. The cataclysm has opened a pathway from the burning steps and now Black Rock Oaks pour into Northshire Valley. They have taken over my vineyard and are burning it to the ground. To the ground! Please, Pat, that vineyard is all I have. Take my fire extinguisher. Alright, we'll take your fire extinguisher and put out the fires. Thank you for the. Fu it's like this weirdest fire extinguisher. This is a fire extinguisher. The hell is this? It's like a. It's like a. It's like a backpack fire extinguisher. Okay, so. Oh yeah, never showed you guys the map. The map. It's easier to really tell where you gotta go. So you're in this little tiny area. You know to start out, they always start you in like a little. All the games do it. Actually, you know what? A lot of the Asian games don't. They start you up in like a big city. I prefer to be. You know, I prefer to start off in these like little spots where it's like easy to learn the game. And guys, um, the graphics in this game, they're mediocre, but they're really, you know, the, the game has a really nice landscape, even though the graphics are, you know, a bit older. This game from 2004, I want to say. So yeah, there is some, uh, the graphics are bad. They're okay. Not great. Sometimes you'll notice that some things look a little iffy, which, which is fine. I mean, I, I don't care. I'm not too big on graphics. Clearly, um, 
I'm not. I play Minecraft, so I don't really care about the graphics. But some games, oh, the new games, some of them, they just look so amazing. Like, that's why I'm always, I'm like one of those people that, like, wants to play the new games when they come out, usually. Because I'm like, wow, that looks, that looks awesome. Like, it looks like, it looks as real as I do. So I want to play. But, um, usually they suck. They really do. This one's, you know, it's an older game. Worst graphics, worst, worst graphics. But, um, what is that, like a gun? He, it's not a fire extinguisher, it's just a water gun. Like a giant water gun I'm using. Which is pretty cool. Let's take a look at that. That is like a huge water gun. I don't, and look how much water is coming out of it. I don't even know where it's coming from. It's like this little... It like it's. There's no way that that much water could come out of this this gun. It's kind of a big gun, but it's like freaking coming out like a fire hydrant. Alright, so I'm going to kill these people. Oh, you're killing them first. That's okay. It's, you know, let's give them a wave. Try to interact with the... When you're in a game like this, you got to interact with the other players, you know? you got to give them a nice wave. Or hello. Okay, so we need to kill... We need to kill a bunch of these. And um, this game doesn't get too bad with it. For you guys that have played MMORPGs before, um... Usually the quests are pretty quick in this game. If you played the Asian games, like I said, they start you off in big cities a lot of times. Not a big fan of that. But, it, you know, sometimes sometimes the games are still good. doesn't mean it's a bad game. It's just um, sometimes it's a little better to start off like in these little areas. So you're not like overwhelmed because it's it's not good to overwhelm new players to games. But um, what the hell was I saying? I don't I don't even know what I was saying. I was saying something about Asian game. Oh, Asian games. Yeah, yeah. They um, a lot of the time, like um, you gotta kill like a hundred monsters. It's ridiculous. Sometimes, not all the games, but usually they start you off like this. And, like, they, like, add, like, a couple monsters every quest, and all of a sudden you have to kill, like, like, 200 monsters. It's ridiculous. Like, I've had, like, some games I even like. There's, like, I like the games. And some games you don't mind grinding it. Like, Atlantic Online is, like, probably my favorite. Like, maybe one of my favorite games really is. Not It's not very popular. I really like it because of the battle system is, like, um, reminds me of, it's kind of like Final Fantasy style. That's why I really like it. But the, you have some quests that could take hours. Like, one quest. In this game, you can always just bust out the quests, which is good. It always keeps you going because it's easy to get bored if, you know, you're stuck on something for a long time. And you can tell that these this stuff's easy. Like, they start you off with the game really easy. I'm killing... None of the monsters can even get to me. Of course, I picked Hunter, so I'm ranged. So I'm kind of avoiding everything. But that's that's all good anyway. So we're up to level 4. Maybe we get to level 5 and then we'll we'll call it. I'm interested in if people enjoyed the watching this or not. I don't know. It's fun to play at least. So I, I don't I don't think I could this fire will not go out. Let's, let's give it another try. This poor bush. Is that even what she wanted us to fix? It was like her crops. I'm like I'm like saving the bushes and the trees. I need to fix it. This is like this is like the like I I don't think there's any saving this. Have you seen this? If this is like uh, I didn't really read the quest. Well, I read it, but I didn't really pay like super attention, but I don't it doesn't look too good. There's nothing growing. There's fires, and there's these scary, evil people in it. So, yeah, I think she's screwed. Even me putting out some fires is not going to help us here. I'm trying not to track these guys. Because, as you can see, they are in red. So, these guys are aggressive. And I'll just show you. I'll show you. Kind of close. Or get a human. So, yeah. They're right after you. So, that's why you want to be careful, usually, around these areas. Because you can just run and <laughs> just get wiped. Like, owned. It happens. It'll, it'll happen to me. I tend to die a lot. I, I gotta say, I'm not bad at the game, but I tend to. Oh, I, th I tend to think I'm better than I am. I admit it. Sometimes I just run in there, think I can kill everyone at the same time. And yeah, I usually play this game with Jen. Sometimes I play with her, and yeah, she dies a lot less than I do. I have to say, although in Skyblock, you know, she is dying quite a bit more than me. But that's because she didn't start playing it when I did. I am known for my deaths in these games. Just, I'm talking more about when I'm, like, questing, like, the less serious stuff. When I'm, when I'm serious, obviously, I'm not dying. And there's, there's some pretty bad, the, actually, there's some pretty bad players we're going to save, which is probably, the most entertaining stuff in this game is probably the people that I'll meet. I have met some of the weirdest people in the world. So I might, I'm going to talk about it, you know, as I journey through this Let's Play, some of the weirdos I have met. I have met some really, really, really strange people, I have to say. Strangest people of any games I've ever played. Every single one was from World of Warcraft. I've met at least maybe 20 weird, weird, like really weird. I don't mean just like acts a little strange because like half the people do. I mean like there's something wrong with this person strange. 
And I don't mean it in a bad way. I just mean like, the, like wow. Like someone you've never met in your entire life. Okay, so. <clears throat> Girl voice. Bless your heart, pet. You truly are a hero of the light. I totally agree with her. Hero right here. I put out those fires like a boss. Through the land is a completely incinerated and there is nothing left of the vineyard but ash and debris. I still might be able to recover, right? How bad can it be? <laughs> You wait till you see it, woman. My god, it looks horrible. Okay, so she gave us... So, like, her prize to us is a cape. Like, she thinks I'm awesome, so she gave me a cape. That's that's cool. A pink cape? Come on. Come on, a pink cape? I can't wear a pink cape. I guess I could. And what'd she give us? A nice, she gave us a nice bag. A nice bag. A grape picking sack. So, oh, I can put my grapes in there. Thank you. All right. Have you killed the rampaging orc hordes? Yes, I have. Blackrock orcs will surely fall now that their main force has been defeated. Only one task remains. Let's see what we get here. We get to choose. Can't wear either of these. They're in red. I don't wear. You don't wear a, a weapon. I can't wield them. I cannot wield these. Um, so, a couple weapons. Oh, let me see something, actually. Something looks a little weird. Whoa! They took away the weapons. No weapons anymore for, for Hunter. Because usually, I guess that... You know what? This is a great idea. Because what happens, guys, is... um. There's so many stupid people, um, they, like, need not, if, and you can roll for gear in dungeons that drops, and so many stupid hunters, they, they roll on, like, weapons that are not for them at all, so they just took away the weapons, that's a good idea, we just use crossbows, so none of this is gonna do me any, anything, really, that's good, that's good, I like the, there was a lot of complaints I saw, at least when I was looking at the patch notes, but I think they were pretty damn good, they were good patch notes, in my opinion, but probably more because I'm casual, the more serious people are, like, real pissed about it, but whatever. Like, they're giving, like, all our pets were are usable now on all of our characters, on all our servers, all our mounts, which I think is awesome. All our achievements as well, I believe. Where's the achievement section? I probably have to unlock them, though. I probably have to be higher level, because I can't have achievements that I am not high enough to get yet. But no, you can actually see them right here. Like, War so like Azul the Rub and stuff. Probably my last character. They're under the achievement section. So yeah, I don't have the points. Or maybe, no, oh, these are, maybe they just, I'm not sure, oh, so I do have my achievement points. I think maybe it's just from the server. You know, not every server. Maybe that's how it works. Maybe it's just all from the server. I don't know, I didn't read real thoroughly. But yeah, these are the achievements I had on my other character. I don't have an 85s on this one. But yeah, let's go through the mounts, I guess. I, I guess the, I have to unlock the other mounts. I do have another mount. I had a, also, I got a turtle mount. I'm just talking right now. I'm <laughs> just talking. I'm not really doing anything. Okay, I'll start walking towards where we need to go. But yeah, I'm really into it right now, guys. I'm really talking a lot. But um, I, I caught this awesome turtle. I never caught on any of my characters before when I was fishing. I just fished up a random turtle. I'm so happy about that. It's like the, it's like the shittiest like mount to ride on land. It goes like it goes like like this quick. But it's but no one like not many people have it. And it goes like sort of quick in the water. I don't know. But yeah, we are level five and we're wearing a pink cape. But you know, you know, it takes a real man to wear this. And that's me. And this kind of looks like me. <laughs> okay, maybe not. You never know. You guys don't know what I look like. This could be this could be my twin, for all you know. All right. Well, anyways, um, I think I'm gonna call it for the episode, guys. I'm interested in if people enjoyed the episode or not because I'm just starting this let's play and I do want to I do want to play through it. And this is an easy thing to get up every day. So let me know what you think, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to you know comment, rate, and subscribe. See you guys later.